All right. So earlier today, I saw that new Shazam movie. Shazam. Shazam. Shazam movie. Uh, I was not planning on it, but I was at a movie theater, and it was showing in like 15 minutes. So I wandered in. It's kind of good. I don't. It's kind of. It's kind of good. It's not here. Okay. So the pros are: it's an extremely weird movie. It is uh, not boring, definitely. And it's occasionally like extremely funny. Um, the cons would probably have to be that it's a very weird movie. Um, there's like 15 or 20 jump scares for some reason, which I just, I have a, a irrational aversion to that. It's like my least favorite trope and there's a trillion of them. And also like there's a lot of jokes that don't land. So it's occasionally like, like I would say 30 to 40% of the humor in that movie works for me. Anyways, that is not what I'm talking about today. What I'm talking about today is a thought that kept occurring to me while watching this movie. Um, I don't know if y'all have seen the trailer for, shit, what's it called? Doom, Doom Annihilation, is that right? Yeah, there's this movie Doom Annihilation. Uh, I'm, I'm sure everyone on YouTube already talked about how bad this looked when it came out a month ago. I'm not gonna rehash any of that here. Uh, doesn't look like a good Doom movie, whatever. W what I noticed though, <laughs> while watching Shazam is it's a way better Doom movie than the Doom movie. Um, now, what do I mean by that? Um, well, I've got five reasons. Do I have five? I've got four or five reasons uh, why it's better, why it's a better Doom movie than the Doom movie. Uh, reason number one, Shazam has way better hell stuff in it. I, I This isn't even spoiling anything yet, but like in the trailer, there's a lot of hell stuff. You see that, there's that scene in the trailer where the, Actually, I'll just show it to you, but I'm going to put Doom music on it to make it my point seem more convincing. Watch this. You see what I mean? That's like way, that's that's Doom. I, I get more of a Doom feeling <laughs> looking at that with Doom music on top of it than I do watching anything in the Doom Annihilation trailer. So that's point number one. Point number two, uh, there's demons in the uh, Shazam movie and they look like Doom demons. As a matter of fact, they look a lot more like Doom demons than the, the sort of gray <laughs> like zombie things in Doom. Annihilation. Like there's one that looks straight up like Baron of Hell, like straight up traditional demon demon. But then there's also one that looks a lot like a Kako demon and its mouth even opens up at one point in the movie to look exactly like a Kako demon. So that's pretty compelling, I think, right? Like it's literally, I could, I could have cut together 60 seconds of this movie and make a better Doom trailer than the Doom trailer that they put out. Um, I should have saved that for the end, huh? Uh, reason reason number three, um, and this is not a very good one, but I needed to have I needed to pad this out. Uh, the Shazam movie seems to care a lot more about video games, like to the point where there's like overt, sort of weird, distracting references. There's one kid in the foster home who's like the his whole character trait is gamer. Like that's his only personality trait. So he's got like a Razer headset on and a Razer phone, but it's also a punchline. And so it's like, did Razer pay for a sponsorship here? Cause it's, it's a lot of branding, but also it's, it's always played as a, as a goof. Um, but the, so there's that, there's a scene of characters playing Mortal Kombat at one point and they make, they make the Shazam kid Raiden cause he's got the lightning powers, I guess, but he's sitting on the wrong side of the screen. Anyways, that bothered me whatever um also like a character makes a verbal reference to watchdogs at one point <laughs> which is like so weird like human beings don't talk about watchdogs out loud in 2019 it's very odd very, took pulled me out of it way more than seeing the, the shazam man do the flossing dance which i'm gonna cut this out there's no way this is gonna be in the final video but I kind of want to know about the production pipeline that every Hollywood studio making a PG to PG-13 movie has had to put in place to retcon the flossing dance into their movies. Because it's definitely in the Sonic movie coming out, right? It might be in Detective Pikachu. I could definitely see them making Mr. Mime do it. And 
it's in Shazam, but I f- would I would have assumed that this movie wrapped principal photography at, like before the floss dance happened. I don't. It's not whatever. That's a different video. No, it's not. I'm never making that video. Uh, what was that? Point number three. Point number four. Uh, point number four is my favorite one, which is at one point in the movie, uh, and I found a clip of it. Uh, the, the little boy version of Shazam opens a door, and it sounds like this. Bill, you're still gonna do it though, right? I mean, what? what, what? If you didn't catch that, right? Right? It sounds exactly. <laughs> The door opening sound from Classic Doom. I don't know why it sounds like that. Uh, maybe video games have... No, it, no, no. I'm standing up for... I'm defending this. That's the Doom door sound. I don't know why it's in Shazam. Other than that, they wanted me to make a video about how it's a better Doom movie than Doom Annihilation. So, uh, well, check, checkmate. DC, you tricked me and you got me. Reason number five. Well, my final reason is not... I don't have five reasons. I only came up with four reasons. Um, but the fifth fifth one, I just wanted to talk about this. <laughs> when I was when I was watching the trailer to make this video, uh, I was watching the scene, you know, in the trailer where there's a scene where he's like, I'd like to purchase some of your finest beer, please. And then later in the trailer, he walks out with the beer. I noticed that in the trailer, it's not beer. They, <laughs> they digitally altered the drink to make it like a purple container of what's either appears to be sparkling water because there's bubbles on it or um or like grape soda but that's not what it looks like in the movie you look at it side by side i i think i'm the only one who's noticed this but they're it's different they digitally altered it which is insane because in the trailer itself he verbally references that he's buying beer so why would they edit i don't understand that that doesn't make any sense anyways shazam (laughs) stupid fucking video shazam is a better doom movie than doom annihilation and that's my thesis for today. Have a wonderful mon. Mu- have a wonderful. Oh, fuck. By the time I finish editing this, it's going to be Tuesday probably. Have a wonderful Tuesday. Uh, also, also, you don't need to see this movie. It's not. It's like it's. It's only good if you like. If you compare it to a bunch of bad movies. You don't need to see Shazam. Don't let people talk you into seeing it. Goodbye. <laughs>